Hey fantasy fans, it's Dan here with Tree Beer Book Reviews, and today, you probably saw from the thumbnail, I got a big unboxing. Um, I got the leather-bound editions of Mistborn and Elantris, so um, I'm just going to break these down, we're going to open them together. Uh, I haven't opened it yet, obviously, so let's get into it. All right, guys, so I got my uh, trusty X-Acto knife here. Uh, you know, be careful with these, they are sharp. Just gonna get the box open. So I will, uh, I'll pull each book out and show you that uh, books I got. So I got uh, Elantris, uh, Mistborn, or the Final Empire. It's re been rebranded as uh, Mistborn. And then uh, Hero of Ages and the Well of Ascension, so. Oh, it looks like each one is individually boxed, so that's nice. So this is Elantris, so we got Elantris first. Let's do that. So put my knife away too early, it looks like. So uh, be very careful here. Just like score. Don't want to cut the leather because these, these are leather bounds. So it said Elantris is unsigned. It's an unsigned edition. But that's fine. Like, I mean, I got, I already have a ton of, like, Brandon signed books. So don't want to be too greedy and just have, uh, oh man, it's gorgeous. All right. Wow. Okay. So here it is. I'm going to take all the, uh, the plastic off. So just show you here. It looks like you know, the silver foil, but I'll take this all off once we got them all out and, uh, you know, we'll look at them all together. So that's Elantris. Let's put this over here. Okay, let's start with Mistborn. Oh, Mistborn, here we are. So these ones are funny because um, Brandon actually had to change his um, original publisher for these because the, the color that was on the original Leather Bounds was called Corona. The color was Corona. So he had to uh, change his publisher to get the the same similar color um but yeah just under a different name so it's just so silly that they had to change their name so wow look at this got the allomantic symbols I said i'll take all this off look at that i don't even i'm not sure i don't know i don't have all the symbols memorized like i'm a i'm a you know a fan but i'm not like you know those like those guys over at the 17 shard who just who know everything about everything um like brandon sanderson like some of the stuff they know is just crazy like they like i've watched a few of their videos and they're just like yeah a little nuts so oh uh, yeah we're gonna unbox all these and then um we'll take the plastic off and i'll show you some of the artwork show you the signatures and stuff like that so yeah these are i hope so the reason i got these just because hey i don't have them and i really wanted them and I had a bit of extra cash lying around that I could, you know, just treat myself. Like, me and my wife, my wife and I are big Sanderson fans. And, you know, with Sanderson, like, he's obviously popped off with his big Kickstarter and his, um... Ooh, look at that one. So, look at that. So that one's just so gorgeous. So, this is obviously got the uh, attention. So, we got the Hero of Ages. This is the last one. I've, I've opened it. <laughs> Not in order here. And, again, the gold foil. Yeah, so, like, his Kickstarter's popped off. You know, with these these secret books, let's get rid of this box, and which is you know nothing sells older books like new books. So I'm sure he sold a lot of them, and, it's, uh, and that's one of the reasons why I bought these too. Because I'm thinking, ah, uh, you know, the way things are going with Brandon, he's these aren't going to be in stock for much longer. So I thought, you know, what the heck, bite the bullet, buy these now before they get too crazy. And especially because, like, I want to get the the Mistborn Era Two uh, leather bounds because Miss Era, I love Era Two, absolutely adore Era Two, and uh, so I wanted to get those and at least have then then I'll have the full set. So here we go. We got Well of Ascension. So oh, that one's not the. Uh... So look at these. Oh man, they're gorgeous. Okay, guys, I'm gonna cut here. I'm gonna take all the plastic wrap off, and uh, then we're gonna do a deep dive on each book. All right, guys, as you can see here, I got them all unboxed. Uh, they just look absolutely stunning. Um, <laughs> I've got them here on my felt uh, tablecloth. So what I'm gonna do is 
we're going to go through each book. Just look at some of the cover art or some of the arts that are in here. All the art is cover art from the all the international covers of the book. So, yeah, let's uh, let's start with Elantris, I think. Okay, Elantris. So here's the uh, got the symbols here. Look at that. Just absolutely gorgeous. The edge. And then the back again is just the same. All right, so let's get into the cover here, guys. Or get on the inside. So I've just moved my lights around a bit so we can actually get a look at the artwork here. I'm just going to zoom in. Look at that. This is probably my favorite of the uh, the Alondras covers. You've got Wraithen standing on top of Alondras, the walls of Alondras. So there we are, 10th Anniversary Dragon Seal Edition. This is like the North American cover here. Again, we've got Wraithen and Serene. See, this is the UK cover. I really don't like it. It's just a bit lame, I won't lie. Um, but it's still nice art. We've got Ray. I think that's supposed to be Raiden and Serene. These are kind of cool. I don't know if these are, like, are the Japanese or Korean art. If I, if I get it wrong, I'll, uh, I'll put up a correction on the screen. This is nice, too. So it's like serene on the outside, and then it looks like Raiden on the inside. Really cool, absolutely gorgeous. And then this is just a note on Seons, how they work. That's cool. I like how they got the map. Very cool. So this is good because it shows you like some of the. The symbols and stuff that you'll see throughout the book. So this one again is an unsigned copy. So I think we're gonna get to the end here. Yeah. So yeah, and then there's one last bit of art right at the back. Looks like serene as well. So really cool, absolutely gorgeous. So that is Elantris. Okay, let's get on to Mistborn. Here she is, look at the beautiful symbol. I don't know what that one is. <laughs> I'll have to look them all up. Maybe I'll put it on screen like once I've like once I've looked at it. It might even show us in here. I think each book has its own like the different allomancy table. So like this one's got probably allomancy, then ferrochemy, and then um <clears throat> hemallergy. Oh, look at that with Vin and like Cretic Shaw right in the background. So these I think these the artwork in these ones are the best. For sure. So this one, Mistborn. There's the American cover with the. Uh, I think these are just supposed to be like practicals or uh, members of the Inquisition because these aren't steel inquisitors because they don't have the spikes in their eyes. Ah, see, look, there we go. Okay, so they were meant to be steel inquisitors because now they have spikes in their eyes. So very cool. Oh, there's the other other copies of Vin. Look at that, just so cool. Wow. Again, see, like the UK art just kind of sucks. It's a bit boring. See, this is cool. I don't know what country does this. I will look it up. This is sweet too. Like the the Mistborn art is always amazing. Look at this. All these amazing artwork of Vin. Looks like Vin and Kelsier. Kelsier is one of my favorite characters. So. Gosh, look at that. It's like Vin in her dress. She's going to the balls. So again, we've got some maps of like Scadrial and the Empire. Luthadel. I can't wait to see the maps of like, uh, you know, the second era. Okay, so what, what are we looking at here? It's the Alamax. Is this iron then? Yeah, so this iron. Right here. So, if we look at the Alimantic table. This would be a long video, I think. <laughs> yeah, Mistborn. And then, so there's always, again, the art right at the back, which, wow, look at that. Look at amazing, amazing artwork. There. Let's, okay, let's get on to the next one. We'll do Well of Ascension. Oh, this one's heavy. Okay. This one's cool. I, I opened, I unwrapped this one. My wife unwrapped most of them. But uh, this one's really cool. So you got to see Vin shooting the coins. 
the well of ascension again that one's okay artwork it's not my favorite i don't think it really expresses vin that well these ones are cool this one's really cool again uk art this is probably one of the better the uk arts but it's still not great looks like there's vin and then ten soon and ellen so still this this art this is cool i love this Put some better lighting on there again there's vin and ellen awesome this is cool that's really cool see it's just like i just heard that big ass sword is awesome vin has got to be one of the best protagonists in any kind of novel oh, look at that uh ten soon the chondra is one of my favorite misborn characters just lo love that. Okay, so now this is one of, my, one of my favorites. As you see on the other side, the coins being shot at someone. So, excellent. Absolutely cool. So, that is the Well of Ascension. Alright, last one, Hero of Ages. So, one of my... Um, so, here we go, Hero of Ages. So, one of my subscribers has asked me, you know, oh, you're going to have all the, the leather bounds now. Why don't you look at, tell us like what your favorite... Mistborn or you know Brandon Sanderson leatherbound artwork is so that's something a video I'm going to come out with in the future is uh oh I don't think I actually showed you guys for well of, Asc or well of ascension sorry is the uh, the signature page so this one is signed by Brandon if I can find it there we go we got the Ferrochemi table. Well of Ascension. And there we are. There's a signature by Brandon. So that one is signed. And this one, Hero of Ages, is signed as well. Alright, so there's... I think that's supposed to be Ellen or Kelsier, but it might be Kelsier. I don't know if Ellen actually had a miscloak. Again, yeah, this is the like North American art. It's okay. This is the new like North American art with the Coloss. That's kind of cool, like the Coloss look. And same for this one. This is another North American art. I think I have this copy in like paperback. Finally, some Sazed art. Like love Sazed. I mean, he was a bit annoying in this book, but I do love him in general. And they're obviously Vin and Ellen. Good shot of that. Uh, actually, you know, that's probably my favorite of the UK art. That's not bad. It's not terrible. Still, that's really cool. Yeah, wow. See, this is so cool. And there's more Vin and Ellen. Looks like the final showdown here. Just says it. Vin, Ellen. I thought this was supposed to, be, supposed to be Spook, I think. Or is that Spook? Or is that Kelsier? I don't know. I'll bring that one closer. That one's kind of cool. That's sweet. More Vin and Ellen. So obviously, like, this one, yeah. Like, Vin and Ellen are, like, married in this book. So there's probably a big focus on, on them. Oh, and this looks like Sazed. So yeah, a lot of focus on Sazed and then Vin and Ellen together in this in the artwork in this book. So now we have the hemallergic table with the spikes. Pretty cool. Hero of Ages. And then there's Brandon's signature. And let's go right to the the back here. Let's see what the artwork is here. Oh cool. Okay, so I can show you one at a time. Actually, I might have to do this. There we go. Vin and Ellen fighting some coloss all right i'm gonna bring it back to me here guys and then we'll uh, i think we'll put them on the shelf when you come back they'll be on the shelf all right there guys oh here we go they're all on the shelf um obviously i have to do a bit of rejigging i'll have to figure out what i'm gonna do with my other hardbound copies of elantris and warbreaker but again these look stunning on the shelf like i'm gonna be getting more leather bounds obviously in the future with um <laughs> you know words of radiance coming out and then the you know mistborn era too so Eventually, this whole shelf will be leather bounds uh, one day. So, 
yeah, it's really happy I bought them. They're super, they're super nice. They're absolutely gorgeous just to have on the shelf. Um, you know, Brandon Sanderson is one of my favorite authors, and I think it's going to be even cooler when we get these new books from, uh, like, these secret books. I know they're not going to be leather-bound, but they're going to look pretty cool. Like, I think they said they're going to be maybe a, a similar type of texture or a similar type of look to The Way of Kings Prime. So, pretty excited for that. Like, at the rate Brandon Sanderson writes, I'm going to have, like, I might have a whole bookcase that is Brandon Sanderson by the time, you know, we're done collecting his uh, his work. But who knows? Like, he's, like I, I still don't have all of his books, I don't think. Like, I don't have uh, Star Sight. I don't have Skyward. So, I have Cytonic, but, yeah, like, <laughs> I don't have everything. And like I said, I got, like, almost a few couple full shelves of Brandon Sanderson. So, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. I hope you enjoyed going through the artwork for me again uh, I'm gonna be coming out with another video in the future like going through my favorite uh, of the artwork and all these these leather bounds so anyways that's it for me guys uh, wish you all the best and uh, cheers <laughs>